Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the stage your host for the Aircom Junior Spider Awards, Aiden Power. Really? You're whooping and cheering? I'm not in one direction, but thank you very much. So, hello everybody, how are you? Good afternoon, you all still awake? I know some of you had very early starts this morning, but I hope it's been worth it. It's been a great day so far, and it's going to get even better as we present the 2013 Aircom Junior Spider Awards. And let me be the first, maybe people have said it to you already, but let me say it now. Well done, each and every one of you, for getting this far today. You're all brilliant. We've got plenty of awards to hand out today, but really getting this far is winning in itself. The work you've done throughout the year, with the help of your teachers, uh, has been brilliant and it hasn't gone unnoticed and it's going to be rewarded richly today uh, when we start handing out the awards. But before we do that and before we begin officially this afternoon, uh, to say a few words to you, I'd like to invite to the stage <clears throat> the Chief Commercial Officer uh, of Aircom, Carol Ann Lennon. Hi everybody, good afternoon. It's, um, I'm delighted to be here in the RES today on behalf of Aircom and celebrating the best examples of web activity in our schools. So you know we all moved our venue um, and we've also changed the time and so instead of being pre-Christmas we're pre-Easter so we hope that made it a little bit easier in terms of travelling for some of you guys to get here. So we came from 20 counties around Ireland so it's great to extend a warm welcome to everyone here from Donegal to Cork, from Belfast to Wexford, as well as a big representation from our local Dublin schools. And it's great that you've all done so well and made the shortlist for this year's Aircom Junior Spiders. So this is my third year to um, chair the judging panel. And I'm delighted to report that as well as the fact that we had a 24% increase in the number of people taking part this year, we also, the judges all really noted and were really impressed by the increased quality of the participation in this year's project. So that was great. So well done to you all. I suppose when we think about the web, it's a great tool that you all have to use not just for learning, because some of your projects were about learning, but also about pursuing the other interests that you have outside the classroom. You're the internet generation, and it's no surprise that you find innovative digital learning solutions to all the normal school subjects, from science to art to history, to revising for exams. But you're also pretty cool at designing Formula One cars, providing music blogs, fashion and shopping advice, and even some gaming. So we can see, and the judges all commented, that the web is allowing you to do many new and exciting ways of showing your creativity and enjoying yourselves. I'm sure you're all delighted and proud to show off your work here today, and I hope you really enjoyed yourself. Last year, we noticed how everyone had included social media in your entries. We, all, we know that you're all, unlike my generation, naturals when it comes to using social networks. We were also very impressed with the talent you showed for design, the richness of your content across the blogs, podcasts, and all your work. So I suppose at Aircom, we try to play a key role in enabling people to connect with each other using most modern communications from broadband to mobile. This is why we've been supporting these awards over the years. Supporting your creativity and innovation is a natural part of this, and the Aircom Spider Awards are an important vehicle to showcase your use of technology and to recognise what you and your teachers are doing every day in the classroom. We also try to provide some relevant broadband um, networks and devices for you to use, and study aids, so like Aircom Study Hub. So if you don't know about it, it's powered by exam support. It's an online study support service for leaving and junior cert subjects. It's free to all Aircom home broadband, pack um, broadband packages. And once you register, you can get access for free to 400 hours of video tutorials. So, so far we've had over 32,000 Irish families use the study packs. And this year we're adding oral Irish and also some extra maths packs and arts and crafts. So they'll all be coming over the coming weeks. So now to our thank yous. I'd like to extend a big thank you to all the schools here today, the principals, the teachers for supporting these awards. The work that your teachers do is often voluntary and it's great that they encourage and develop use of the internet and digital media in schools. The drive of the teachers is an important agenda in our schools and your contribution isn't hailed as often as it should be. So I'm delighted that we'll be presenting a special award for outstanding contribution to online education later on. 
Another big warm welcome is to the judging panel, our sponsors on the ODS. I'd like to record my appreciation to this year's judging panel whose interest and hard work in arriving at such a quality of shortlist was based on very diligent evaluations of our entries and some robust discussions at our judging sessions. I'd like to thank the sponsors as well as the many educational organisations and bodies who are supporting this programme and indeed IT programmes generally in schools. Thanks to everyone in the RDS and a special thank you to our partners in business and finance, in particular Ian, Louise, Lucy and Sinead, who as always work really long and hard hours to make sure these awards are a success. But finally, the most important people in the room, a huge congratulations to all of you here today. You are our future internet entrepreneurs and heroes, and I know you'll all go on to do great things. Ireland has a great record in the internet space. It's very gratifying to know that one of our earliest junior spider winners, James Welton, has gone on to win the Internet Hero of the Year Award at the main spider awards for his work on Coder Jojo. James is here today, and I'd like to congratulate him on his continued success. It is more usual for countries to import digital skills from Silicon Valley, but James has achieved the reverse by exporting his Coder Dojo concept from Cork to California. So I'm quite sure we have some future internet heroes in the room today, and I'll follow all your careers with interest. Enjoy the rest of your day, good luck with the awards, and have a great Easter. Thank you. Thank you very much, Carol Ann. Now, ladies and gentlemen, keep your applause going for a man who's going to grace the stage and blow your mind, and maybe even blow up a few things too. Will you welcome, please, Jack Wise. Well, hello, boys and girls, mums and dads, teachers. Thank you very much for coming along. My name's Jack Wise. I met some of you earlier. Clap your hands if I met you earlier. Clap your hands to people. Oh, great, this is good. For the people who didn't meet me, my name, I'm actually a magician. I should tell you that now, in case it's not obvious by the end of this. I also do a little bit of comedy. So basically, if you see something in the next couple of minutes, if it's not funny, it's the magic. Just thought I should explain that. I also do some sword swallowing and some ventriloquism, but not at the same time, because it scares the living daylights out of the puppets. <laughs> so by a round of applause, who here would like to see me swallow this sword? Clap your hands if you want to see me swallow Okay. Yeah, okay, okay. By a round of applause, who here would not like to see me swallow the sword? <laughs> Thanks, Mum. <laughs> by a round of applause, who here would like to see me hurt myself swallowing this sword? <laughs> What kind of a crew? What kind of an audience have we got? Okay, before we do that, we'll do that at the end, we need to get, we need to get somebody up here on stage. Is, is anybody having their birthday? Hands up. Who's having their birthday? What's your name? Thomas Higgins and Jamie, you're both having your birthday. Is somebody telling a porky pie? Or are you both having your... You, you're both having, they're both having their birthday, are they really? Yeah, well that's kind of crazy. Okay, here, hang on. We need to get a couple of kids up, so which one's actually having their birthday? You are, okay, come on up here, we get you up, and you're coming up, we, we, I know it's not your birthday, but I think it is his, we need to get, we, hang on, stay there for a second, we need to get six more people, hey, where, where are Carol Ann's kids, where are Carol Ann's kids, I met them before, Carol Ann's kids, uh, hey, good to see you again, put it up there, man, that's things, all right, look at you, you got all your teeth this year, huh, last year you looked like you had a visit from the tooth fairy, but you had a crowbar, come on over there, okay, stand over, that's four, we need a couple more, let's see, we need to get, yeah, Five, six, seven, eight from this row. Come on up, up you come. Your teacher's pointing furiously at you. Look at, look at the kids going, I don't want to, I don't want to. And the teacher's going, get up those stairs, you're getting extra homework, get up the stairs. How many is that? We've got four, five, six. I've never done this before, but we thought we'd give it a go. You're coming up, you say, oh, no, no, no. What about over here? Yeah, this girl here, I met you earlier. You're coming up, come on over. And what about yourself? Just because you don't look at me, it doesn't mean I can't see you. Come on up, up you come, up you come. Give them a big clap, come on people, give them a clap. Come on. Look at that, the speed of a postal worker. Come on over here. Oh. Hi, yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to wake you over there. Where's the kid whose birthday it is? What's your name? No, Jamie. Jamie, Jamie, get up those stairs. He's selling a porky pie. Well, we'll figure it out in a minute. Come on, everybody up. Give him another clap. Come on, give him another clap. Okay, we're going to try something crazy up here. We're going to try and get you guys to play happy birthday for Jamie and the other birthday boy whose name is, what is your name? Hmm? Thomas. It's, oh, uh, look at, he comes up on stage and he goes, it's not really my birthday. 
So it's Thomas's birthday. It is, it is your birthday, is it? It is your, it is, it is now, shut up, kid. Okay, so, okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try something kind of wild. We're gonna play birth, happy birthday for Thomas. Now to do this, we've got a couple of these things. Basically, the kid next door, he has a tent, and I got a tool kit for Christmas. He kept on kicking the football over the wall, so I got out the saw, and now he doesn't have a tent. But we, uh, we have got one of these pipes for each of you. There you go, you grab that. Okay, stand forward a little bit, but don't fall off the stage. We don't want you to fall off, not unless you're pushed. Okay, there's one for you. You stand up there. Here's number three, that'll be you. Thomas, stand over there. And number four, that's for you. There we go, number five. Now take the wooden spoon out of the pipe. And there's one for you, thanks buddy. Okay, oh, yours is upside down. Okay, you're gonna hold it by the, uh, hold it by the string, okay? And we're gonna try and play happy birthday for Thomas and Jamie, both of whom are pathological liars. So, okay, move forward a little bit there. You move over here, because you're annoying me a bit. Okay, there, there we go. Okay, you stand here. Okay, here's what happens. When I tap you on the shoulder, you tap the pipe, okay? So hold the pipe up a little bit. Well, you're not a very energetic child, are you? Okay, okay so you t once I tap you, look, look at you. Look at you, are pretty, but you're not the brightest. Hold it the other way around. <laughs> Go on, give it another, give it another tap. Good, 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 good. Okay, yeah, that's a bit aggressive. You're quite an angry little boy, aren't you? Okay, we'll try that again. Less aggression. There you go. Okay. You're the boss's kids, aren't you? Yeah, yeah. Oh, hit it as hard as you like. It's fine, there you go. Okay, so now we're going to try and play it. Don't hit it too hard, but hit it at the bottom of the pipe, right? We'll try and play Happy Birthday. If this works, you'll get a massive round of applause. Let's give it a go. Now remember, if I tap you twice on the shoulder, you tap the pipe a second time. You got it? Okay, so here we go. What's that about? What's that about? <laughs> At the bottom, down the bottom, it's science. With the, the spider, oh, it's science. Okay. <laughs> Who did that? You're gonna, you'll be getting a visit from the Tooth Fairy as well in a minute. Okay. 